my name's Paul and I'm one of the keepers here at Taronga Zoo Backyard Bush. I look after a lot of different animals, including our invertebrates, like the spiders here behind me. I also look after reptiles, amphibians, our domestic animals, a lot of native animals, primates, birds. I pretty much look after a lot of very, very different animals. But today, more specifically, we're going to be talking about our spiders. A lot of people are very afraid of spiders, but really there's no reason to be. Definitely respect them, but you don't need to be afraid of them. Even the world's most venomous spider, the Sydney funnel spider, is nowhere near as bad as what people would have you believe. Despite the fact that people are very afraid of spiders, they're actually something that are really, really good to have around, particularly your house. So something like a huntsman that's running around your house will be doing you a favour. It's getting rid of cockroaches, silverfish, flies, mosquitoes, but without the spiders, we'd be in a bit of trouble. We do have a lot of different kinds of spiders found around our homes, and some of them can be quite dangerous. But the way to stay safe around them is by learning a bit about them. Things like, where would you find them? So something like a redback spider, you're going to find in places that don't get disturbed much. So before you're putting your hands into a run or anything, have a bit of a look first. Something like a funnel web, you might find them in the bottom of a swimming pool. And despite uh, people think they might be dead, it may actually still be alive. If you're cleaning out a gutter or a drain again, or doing some guarding, wear some gloves, because that's where you might be finding the funnel webs. And particularly this time of year, and with all the rain that we've had, they are going to be coming out. A question I get asked quite a lot is, what do I love about spiders? Unfortunately, it's a really, really hard question to answer because there's so many things about them that's really cool and interesting. Things like their web. The web is extremely strong. The way they make their webs. Some webs even have antiseptic properties. The way they hunt for their food is also really cool. Some run after them, some jump after their food. Food gets caught in their webs. There are even some spiders that actually make themselves a home underwater in a little bubble really hard to bring it down just to one or two things that make them really special to me. Come on down here to back out the bush here at Toronto Zoo, have a look at our spiders on display, have a talk to some of our keepers, maybe you'll learn a thing or two and walk out of here a bit happier knowing about them. Yeah.